original Corlust before we became Corlust Westside and we moved out of here. This is how we started. So it was a basement business for a long time. If you guys can check it out, there is the fish tank in the wall. We got corals painted everywhere. If you've been a fan of corals for a long time, you've probably been here. Um, but if you haven't and you're new to the team, and you're new to checking us out, this is the original Corlust. So this is a 220 gallon uh, tank. It's built in the wall. And then I also have over here the 110 tall and that's built in the wall. So we are here today cleaning up this tank. It's been a while. It was completely empty since I spent all my time at the store now. We did rip out the whole system, the frag tanks, everything that was over here. All the fish tanks are gone. So this whole room, if I'll have to post a picture just to show you guys what it used to look like. Good morning, Reefers. I'm Kenya from Coral Austin. Wait a minute a second. Um, I'm feeling orange. There we go. Now I'm feeling better. There's a lot of tanks here. A lot of coral back in the day. So now we have these tanks completely stripped out and cleaned. And what we're going to do is make them predator only tanks. So I don't have really have much time to take care of the corals like I used to. So these are just going to be fish only systems and we're going to have some fun with them. So we have boxes over top and doors so the fish can't jump out which is a great feature, so that means I get to have eels and all kinds of stuff. So we did just order a shark, and we did order a special diamond blue dot stingray. So we're cleaning this out and pretty much getting it ready. Um, I didn't like the sand before. It was a black and white mix, and it was volcanic and very magnetic. So it was getting stuck to the, the glass and the magnets, and it was just scratching, and it was horrifying. So I had to suck that sand out of there, even though it looked absolutely gorgeous. And now we're just going to pimp out the refugiums, clean them up a little bit. That is a 55 gallon tank under there. That's the one tall. And like I said, this is my first, one of my, not first systems, but the first system I had when I moved here. So it kind of looked awesome. But that's what we're going to start working on. I'll give you guys an update later on. So just wanted to give you a quick 30 seconds. As always, thanks for watching. Happy reefing. Please leave in the comments below what you think we should throw in this tank. We already are on the lookout for some super large lionfish. Uh, they look absolutely incredible. Eric has two of them in his tank at home. And that's one of the reasons why I want the volatins because they're super huge and they're just awesome to watch. So triggers, uh, I did order a blue line trigger for here. So he will be going in here also with uh, the eel and the stingray. And, whatever else we find. So we have two tanks, they are empty canvas, and we're gonna get started on them today. So stay tuned for more. And if you haven't, hit that subscribe button, share a video with a friend, until next time.